Coin on. Hey there, YouTube Coin community. This is Dustin with CoinOp. Today is going to start a seven day period of a video a day for seven days. Now, this video is going to be on the America the Beautiful uh, Washington Quarter Double Die Reverse varieties that you can currently find searching your pocket change. So, kick back, relax, and enjoy this video. Okay, first we are taking a look at the Alaska. This is a 2012 Alaska America the Beautiful Homestead Quarter variety. This one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR-006. Now doubling does show the strongest on the back of the sheep's neck. So if you were to look at the back of the sheep's neck, you will see where the doubling occurs. So this is what you're going to want to take a look for. Now do keep in mind that these are all very new varieties, so they do not sell for big, huge money, but they do still trade in circulated conditions for a buck or two up to five dollars and uncirculated conditions upwards of 30 bucks and for really nice higher graded uncirculated examples. So figure if you find one of these, you're sitting on a few bucks. Okay, we are taking a look at a 2013 Maryland quarter. This is the Fort McHenry quarter. Now doubling on this one does show to the west of the lower half of the fireworks spray. It also shows on the left side of the three small windows above the arch. Now there are various other double die reverses for each of these quarters that I'm listing. I will post a link to John Wexler's website so that you can go and take a look at all the various uh, double die varieties that he does have listed for this series. Now to keep in mind, if you were to find one of these, it would trade for a few dollars up to about 30 bucks. Okay, what you are looking at right now is a 2013 Nevada quarter. This is the 2013 Nevada. This one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR-002. When you are looking at this variety, doubling does show underside of the leaves, north of the bottom right bristle cone pine tree. Now doubling can also be seen underside of the tree limbs. So do keep your eyes open for this variety. We are now moving on to a 2013 Ohio double die reverse quarter. This one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR-001. Doubling can be seen on the coat hanging to the left of the upper right leg. So you are looking at the coat right there, the upper right leg, and you will see where the doubling is affected. Now do keep in mind a lot of these double dies because of the way that the mint now does their minting process, the double dies are are more minor compared to double dies in the past, but these are true double dies. We are moving on to a 2013 South Dakota Washington quarter. Once again, this is a 2013 South Dakota. Now this one is listed as WDDR-003. Now doubling does show on the lower part of Jefferson's nose of this one. Once again, the doubling does show on Jefferson's nose. Now, I do strongly suggest that uh, you guys go in, either go to Variety Vista or DoubleDye.com and take a look at all of the different varieties. I am only listing for each of the different states that I decided to use in the video. I am only listing the double dies that, in my opinion, are the strongest and most obvious. There are a lot more double dies than what I am mentioning in this video. Okay, we are moving on to a 2015 Delaware Washington quarter. This is a 2015 Delaware Washington quarter. This one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR-023, WDDR-023. Doubling can be seen as extra blades of grass below the right end of the upper grass strip. Light doubling can also be seen on some of the lower grass strip. 
Um, now, I did try to get some close-ups of this one. This one kind of can be tough to see. There are many different uh, varieties for this particular double die. So I do suggest, once again, to go take a look at all the known varieties for this one. There are a bunch of them out there. And once again, this was a 2015 Delaware Washington Quarter double die reverse. But we are now moving on to a 2015 Nebraska Washington Quarter. Once again, this is the Homestead Quarter Series. This is the, the 2015 Nebraska Quarter. The one that you are looking at is listed as a WDDR-004. John Wexler does have this listed as a best of variety. Now, strong doubling from the top of the water pump shows inside the lower part of the window. Well, the, the third window on the right side. Now, if uh, you are looking for this variety, there are a bunch of different varieties that all feature doubling, either inside of the windows or on the pump handle or both. Uh, just earlier in the week, I myself pulled one of these out of pocket change coming out of a McDonald's. I found one of these varieties. You should be looking at an image of it. I did put it up for sale. And just to give you an idea, it sold for $7. Now, keep in mind, this was a circulated quarter. This is a 2015, so this is a relatively new uh, variety, and I still managed to put it in auction and sell it for $7. So $7 for a 25 cent piece is worth that money to me all the time. Okay, now we are moving on to a 2015 New York Washington quarter. Once again, this is a 2015 New York Washington Quarter. Now, the one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR-001. Once again, this is a double die reverse. All of these are double die reverses that I'm listing. Now, doubling does show inside the lower right opening in the sword handle. Now, if you were to look up close to that little sword handle, you can see where the doubling is evident on this variety. So do keep your eyes open for this. There are a few of these where the doubling is different strengths of it, but it is all in the same generalized area. Okay, we are moving on to the 2016 Kentucky Washington Quarter. Once again, this is a 2016 Kentucky Washington Quarter. The one that you are looking at is listed as WDDR. 008. Once again, that is WDDR-008. Now, doubling on this one can be seen in the fringes of the front man's coat. It is doubled to the left of the upper right arm. Once again, the doubling can be seen on the fringes of the coat. And once again, there are a bunch of different varieties that all show doubling with uh, different uh, strengths, all in the same generalized area. So once again, Go check out Variety Vista or DoubleDye.com and take a look at all the various ones that are out there. There are a lot more than you could probably imagine. Okay, we are moving on to the last one that I am going to be showing you in this short video. We are taking a look at a 2016 West Virginia Washington Quarter. Once again, this is a 2016 West Virginia Washington Quarter. And I'll the one that you are looking at right now is listed as WDDR-004. Once again, WDDR-004, which is a double die reverse. Doubling shows in the windows in the arch above the center doorway. So if you were to take a look at the center doorway, take a look up at the windows. There are a few different varieties that all show different doubling inside of the windows. Now I did choose this uh, type four, is in my opinion the doubling on this one is the strongest and most obvious in my personal opinion now once again if you do happen to find any of these varieties that i showed you uh, keep in mind these are relatively newer double dies they've only been out for a few years so if you do find one of these circulated conditions trade for a buck or two sometimes more uncirculated conditions however trade anywhere from five dollars to thirty dollars and sometimes more for very very high grade uh, uncirculated examples so if you do happen to come across one of these examples even though it is like i said a relatively new variety they still do hold value and in my opinion 
taking something that is worth 25 cents and selling it for $2, well, that's eight times my money, so that's, that's good money to me all day long. So if you are like me and like making money off of money, then take a look at the quarters in your pocket and start looking at some of the newer ones. Once again, we seriously hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, hit that thumbs up button. Hitting the thumbs up button does encourage YouTube to share our content with more and more people. So by hitting that thumbs up button, you help the channel and encourages YouTube to share us with more people. We do have a giveaway that is gonna be coming up as soon as we hit 30,000 subscribers, which we are very close to that mark right now. We are, I think right now at 29,390 subscribers. So we are very, very close to that 30,000 subscriber mark. So do stay tuned. We will be doing a video every day this week. I will keep you posted to the exact day the uh, giveaway happens. I can't tell you exactly when. It all happens when you subscribe. So as soon as we hit 30K subscribers, we will be doing a giveaway. You can always find myself or Robert Lawson in the CoinOp group on Facebook. I will post a link to that as well. Uh, if you have not been to our website, we do have a website. It is varietyerrors.com. Once again, varietyerrors.com. Kyle, who is my publicist and media manager, does an excellent job of keeping the site updated with fresh articles every day, or for the most part, just about every day. But there's always something new on there, so go check it out. And once again, we seriously hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for your view. Please hit that subscribe button and hit that thumbs up button and have fun searching.